What are your thoughts about what, what is happening in Clinton? Very puzzling. Um, there aren't any known earthquake faults close by, and uh, there's no real obvious cause for what's happening. Um, Pe people have suggested uh, uh, so-called cryogenic earthquakes, which is what happens when the ground gets frozen and expands, but it hasn't been f cold in a long time now, and we've had record warmth, so that's pretty much out of the question. Okay. Um, also suggested an earthquake boom. Well, that's just, uh, that really doesn't have any meaning. That's just a sound given off by an earthquake, so that amounts to saying there was an earthquake. All right, and then uh, what about um, so what say, natural gas, not a pipeline, but it's, it, um, it, is there something else that, you know, can you explain that something else that, that occurs naturally that may cause something like this? The, uh, the bedrock under uh, Clintonville is pretty much granite with a little bit of sandstone, so there are no obvious sources of natural gas. Uh, one possibility is groundwater moving through fractures might be uh, setting up some, some vibrations, but uh, that's just speculation. Having been out there yesterday, somebody also suggested that, that the water table is so low that the bedrock is collapsing. Uh, that's actually a reasonably good uh, hypothesis. You know, if the if there, the amount of water in the fractures in the bedrock is less than normal, the rocks might be settling. And it would cause booms like that? Conceivably. Yeah. Um, and then this just in today, the uh, earthquake in Mexico, would that have any effect on what's happening in Clintonville? Um, I haven't even heard about it. Fill me in. There's a, I guess there was an earthquake today registered in Puerto, Puerto Vallarta. Uh -huh. Like around, I can't, I just saw it on the news when I came in. I think it was like around a 7, 7.0 or something like that. Well, Okay, it might have been a fairly strong earthquake, but that's 2,000 plus miles away, so the effect on Clintonville will be just about zero. Um, the closest things the U.S. Geological Survey has picked up is uh, tiny events in southeast Missouri and West Virginia, and they're 1,000 miles away. So they haven't picked up anything in Clintonville. So it's, it's a purely local source of noise. So uh, quite a mystery. Have you ever seen anything like this or heard about anything like I've this? I've had people call in saying that they heard mysterious sounds around their house and I've heard reports of some of these cryogenic earthquakes but having an entire town report booming and and uh, you know vibrations I haven't seen that before it's it is a mystery have they um, has the city or anybody have they contacted you or the, or the university at all or? the city's mostly been talking to Madison nobody from Clintonville has contacted me